I know, I think you were in Australia at the same time that they were filming the next Thor movie, and so being a Marvel <laughs> fan, I'm assuming there's a possibility that Drax might appear in the next Thor yeah. movie. Can you, sir, confirm or deny this allegation? I can't, it's, it's so weird. It's, it's, you know, this is one of those things you always dance around because you don't want to upset anybody, but... Uh, yeah, it's one of those things where I can neither confirm nor deny. But, you know, by coincidence, I was on, I was on a jet with the rest of the Guardians mm -hmm. with Chris Pratt, who can confirm and did confirm, but we were there together. Yeah. And then we traveled to Australia together, and we went and quarantined together, and then we all left at the same time okay. by coincidence. But So, yeah, there is a possibility that you would... <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> that, that, that's, the best, that's the best kind of positive way of neither confirming nor denying, <laughs> but confirming something. <laughs> no, no, no. Hey, Chris Hemsworth, who plays Thor, I met him once briefly. He seems like a lovely guy. Did you get to hang out with him much? I did. Um, Hemsworth is... He's one of those guys, man, like, like, you really want to hate this guy. You look at him, and he's just... He's just picture perfect. <laughs> he's just like a beautiful specimen of a human being. And not only that, but he's got the talent to, care, to go along with that. And you really want to hate this guy, but he's just, he's such a lovable human being. He's just funny and he's grounded. And he's just, you know, like typical Aussie, just super laid back and easy going, just, you know, doesn't take himself too seriously. So, no, nah, I love him. I've had nothing but... Uh, pleasant experiences with him, even way back from, you know, Avengers, watching him being Fat Thor. Yeah. You know, he's just... <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't wait to see you both on screen in the next Thor movie. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Potentially. <laughs> Potentially. Um, you mentioned Guardians, and it's one of my favourite Marvel movies. I know it's James' favourite Marvel movie of all the Marvel Universe films. And I think, can we now... Because you were, you were wary of doing a third one because there was an issue between... Disney, who are Marvel, and James Gunn, the director, but I believe he said he will do it. So are you signed up for a yeah. third movie? Is that happening? I did. Yeah, I, yeah, I signed up. And we, it was funny, because last time I was there, we had a, a pretty lengthy conversation about that. And thank you, for, again, for being so supportive of my stance. But they did. They, they came back around and they rehired James. And he had already been on Suicide Squad, so it got pushed back even further. But he is. We're going to finish this journey together. I'm, ex I'm really excited about wrapping this up, because this... You know, it's a long time coming. We've been waiting, and also the, you know, the kind of uh, the anxiety of not knowing whether James is going to be there with us to finish it. I mean, that left me in a bad place personally and professionally because I was on the outs with Disney, uh, because I just felt like he was, you know, he was done wrong and he should be there to finish. So we're going to wrap it up. We're going to start filming in November, and uh, we're going to wrap this whole journey up. I'm, I'm super excited about it. I can't wait for it. Uh, but I've heard that this is probably going to be your last outing as Drax, that after this uh, movie, even if they make more Guardians films, that you feel that you, you wouldn't be the right person to, to, to play him. You know, I, I, I wouldn't. And, you know, the thing is, is that, you know, I, I didn't think that was going to be news when I said it because I figured everybody, you know, James has already stated that this third will be his last film, and I don't care to, con you know, continue on without James. But also, you know, that's the way these films usually work in trilogies. So I figured it was, you know, I was okay saying that and, yeah. and people weren't going to be upset. But, you know, there's a part of me that is really excited that people are going to miss this character. I don't know. It makes me feel uh, like I did something right. But, uh, yeah, it'll be it. I mean, by the time Guardians 3 comes out, I'll be, I'll be 54 years old and I just... Uh, you know, I'm, I, I don't want to do... I don't want to do... Dave, uh, Dave, Dave, I'm Dave, I'm sitting, Dave we're, sitting, we're sitting in the room with Tom Jones, who just had a number one album at 80. Yeah, but he's Tom Jones. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I can officially announce that the next Drax appearance, Tom Jones will be appearing as Drax in <laughs> Guardian 4, Return yes. of the Welsh Avengers. <laughs> <laughs> uh,